hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Rosanna so in today's video uh-huh halt we're doing empties I wow oh my word I can't remember the last time I did an empty PS that's not even all of it so that is what we're gonna be doing today but before we get into that video I would love 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 for you to subscribe to my channel you could ring the bell it will give you notifications of when I post which is every Tuesday and every Saturday between 1 and 2 ish so yeah like make a comment ring the bell tell your friends subscribe help a newbie out I would so so appreciate your support and thank you so so much for helping me grow this channel and now without further ado let's get started okay where the heck do we begin let's just dive in let's just dive in I'm going to go right wherever the heck is in front of me. Um, yeah, so I got this sample of the It Confidence in a cleanser. It is really, really nice. Now, I'm like, I'm not particular. I just have my routine, and I kind of like it, so I kind of don't deviate. But I did grab this um, as a sample. I don't remember where. It is really, really nice. Um, would I go back and pick up the um, larger one? Not really. I mean, because I really like what I have been using, but I do adore it cosmetics but this is a really really nice product and i'm really really glad i got to use it so that is that this is one another one of my staples that i get all the time this is the ordinary this is a hundred percent plant derived squalene i don't have to tell you anything it is so so beautiful i use this in my nightly routine and if i'm not mistaken um i did do a video a couple months ago on my nightly routine i will link it down below i adore adore this product let me see if i have a little bit left in the jar so i can show you like the consistency okay so can let's see can you see that if you could see that it's very serum-y it's i i don't want to use oily but it's borderline oily but i love and for me personally, I am 54 with mature skin, um, you know, lines, wrinkles, blah, 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 yada, yada. Um, a little bit dry, just in some areas. I love an oil-based anything. It feels so good and it absorbs right in. Let me just tell you real quick about some, um, girl, I'm not a professional, just let me put that right out to you. I learn just like everybody else does. But let me just give you a quick definition of what of what squalene does when you incorporate it in your routine. It balances oil production, provides just enough moisture to keep the skin clear and healthy. Squalene oil also has powerful anti-aging properties, which will help the skin age gracefully, as well as anti-inflammatory benefits to help with skin conditions such as acne and eczema, which I have neither. Who doesn't want an anti-aging product? This is so good. Love, love, love this as part of my nightly routine. Enjoy it. I'm just throwing myself all over the place. So we're going to be all over. We're going to be all over, but it is what it is. Oh, P.S. I see another one right over here before we get crazy. So I have another one right over here. And it's so inexpensive. I think I get it at Ulta for like $9, $7, something like that. So, so nice. This again, I went, I went away. This is the Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balm. You know, it's a classic. Smells like nothing, all gone. I had this, my goodness, now that I'm thinking about it, um, as we're sitting down, this is September, September. I think I bought this when we went to Florida. I forgot to bring like um, some um, uh, makeup remover. When the heck did we go to Florida? Was it in March? I think so. And um, I just finished it because I was like, no, let me just keep it as like a travel. No, no, you use it. Well, I really don't. Let me keep, girl, just friggin' use it. So I did end up finishing it. It is so great. It is, so, again, let me see if I could dig it up for you. You know, it comes like as a solid like this. I love you. Look at that. It, look at that. Can you see that? Do I have a paper towel here or a napkin? No, so you're gonna have to excuse me because um, I have to go get something. I'm gonna wipe my hands. It is such a great emollient. I love I love balms to take off my makeup. Again, like some kind of an oily base. I think it's so, um, so great. So love, love that. I'm so glad I picked that up. This I've had in my bag forever. Now, these are the original um, packages. This is the Honest Beauty. This is the Magic um, Beauty Balm. It's, yeah, I don't know. I know like her um, cream blushes, they changed the packaging. I'm not sure about this one, but this is how long I've had. Girl, look. Okay, so like if you could, I'm going to come super close. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but there's like sand grits all over here. Let me feel it. Yep, I just touched it. I take this everywhere with me so i oh my gosh I, I wonder if you can you yeah you probably could see it better here 
Can you see that? I take this everywhere with me. And I do have like two or three or maybe four backups. It is so good. And I was going to rub it on, but forget it. I don't want any sand on me. Perfect, of course, for your lips. But I also like use it for my cuticles. Sometimes when I'm at work and my hands or my knuckles are dry, I rub them on my knuckles. Sometimes I rub them on my elbows at night. What a great, great product. Now, moving right along. Girl, you see this elf? That's cute. Oh, it's an elf. That's nice. Nothing. Done. This is the Elf, the Elf Solid Sponge Cleanser. I adore, adore, adore this cleanser. I clean all my brushes and my sponges um, with this sponge cleaner. Um, I'll leave a picture of it right over here. It's like a solid, looks like a solid charcoal because girl, I used it all. It is so good. It's, I personally think it's gentle. Such a great, great product. And of course, you know, I have backups. You know, I do. Speaking of Elf, girl, this Elf Holy Hydration Face Cream it is outstanding. This beautiful um, holy hydration face cream comes with hyaluronic acid and peptide complex. It is so, so good. I'm going to tell you, I go across these two for my daily moisturizers. Um, and I'll tell you in a minute the next one. Let me just open up, girl. You know how, you know how I feel about scents. You know that. This smells so friggin' good. All gone. Let's see. Do I have a little bit? Do I have a tiny bit? Okay, tiny bit. That's all I have left. It feels, it feels so mag. Of course, you can't see it, but it feels so magnificent. Ooh, I don't know what it is about this. It feels so good, and it leaves your skin so soft. My face feels so delicious and so plump. Again, this is in my daily routine moisturizers. It is so so good i mean we all know what hyaluronic acid does let me just look this up it is like 13 dollars because they do have um peptide complexes so i just want to be like specific for you because it is so damn good so the hyaluronic acid locks in moisture for a plump complexion oh it feels so freaking good it also has niacinamide in it which minimizes the pores and evens out skin tone peptides to promote collagen and improve skin texture squalene girl you know how i feel about that Squalene improves balance and elasticity. Vitamin B5 soothes and hydrates the skin. So, so beautiful. I adore, adore this product. Yes, amen. I do have backups, plural. Now with my other daily routine, I go back and forth with these two daily moisturizers is the Olay Regenerous Micro um, Sculpting Cream. Again, girl, you know how I feel about scents. But this, they smell clean. They smell, they smell like, like an old school, like moisturizer. I don't want to say like, like baby moisture, like baby lotion or like the original oil of Olay. Maybe that's it. It just has a nice clean scent. I don't know if that makes sense, but so, so good. Nothing, nothing on my sleeve. Let me see if I could, yeah, nothing, diagonal. it. But same thing, it is so, so creamy. Oh, wait a minute, there's, good, there's goodness in the lid. Let me just grab it here. Yeah, so delish. It is so, so delish. Mmm, leaves it so, so nice. But anyway, let's, let's look that up. Okay, so this is called, you know, the red jar, known, known to many as their go-to as their go-to non-negotiable face moisturizer, it's it's the friggin' truth. So their um, the Regenerous Micro Sculpting Face Cream is designed to visibly diminish wrinkles, fine lines starting in day one, infused with vitamin B, three amino peptides, hyaluronic acid, and antioxidants for the ultimate um, penetration. It's true. It, it just goes. It just seeps right on in. It's so good. Um, what the hell was I? This moisture binding fo formula instantly hydrates to improve elasticity um, and firm for. Um, a lifted look. Vitamin uh, B3 not only helps with surface skin cell turnover and regeneration, but also leads to exfoliation that helps remove dead, um, dull skin for a fresher, younger look. Blah, 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 blah. It is so friggin' good. It is so good. They do have a, frag a fragrance free, which, you know, I'm shocked. I'm like, girl, you don't like, but I do like the one that's a little bit scented. It's so, so nice. Like I said, the backup. Yes, I do. And yes, I do. I have backups. These are my go-to right over here that I use um, for my daily moisturizers, back and forth, back and forth. These two are fantabulous, fantabulous. <clears throat> well, I got you in front of me. I might as well talk about you. Adore, I adore, adore this makeup remover, Garnier 
um, skin active micellar cleansing water. I don't. It, this is the this is the waterproof one. When I first first used it, I just grabbed. I don't know. I didn't know. And I know that the pink one was just like for regular, and then the blue is um, waterproof. It is so freaking good, obviously. And I'm just starting um, another bottle of this size. It is amazing. It takes off every ounce of makeup. What I love about it is like I will put it on like a cotton round and I'll just let it sit there for like a moment or two like on my eyelid because it is the eye makeup that I have a hard time with like other cleansers and um, makeup removers. Girl, I need the friggin' eye makeup to be off, you know? So I will do all that and wipe off all my eye makeup and then like on the other side, I'll just go like gingerly over my face because I double cleanse and all that good stuff. But this is amazing. I absolutely love that. Um, girl, I don't have to tell you anything about this little lover. Number one, two. I have like maybe this much left in my third bottle that I'm using now. I do have this on auto delivery from Pixie. I love, love, love. Did you hear me? Did you hear me back there? Love this dog on mist. It's so beautiful. It is the Pixie Hydrating Milky Mist with Hyaluronic Acid and Oat. It's beautiful. First of all, it smells delish. You know when I find something that I like scent on, you're a winner. You are a winner. It is so beautiful. I use it every morning, every night. And if I need like a little pick-me-up during the day, this is it. Adore, adore. I use these like water. They are so fantabulous. So I am absolutely loving that. Girl. You know, I've been gray since I was 15 years old. I will tell you, my mother was full gray at 18. Um, I just started getting patches at like 15, 16. And yep, I get my hair colored like every four weeks, but it's so gray. I really should go every three, but I just, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. This little lover right over here comes in super de duper handy. I, this is probably, I don't know, fifth, sixth, seventh, twelfth girl. I've been using it for a long time. Um, it's a little brush. It looks like a, it looks like a makeup brush. This is the color Wow Root Cover Up. I have mine in medium brown. Girl, don't think I'm gonna get rid of it because I still have a little bit left. Hold on. So it comes like with this little brush right over here. It's filthy. I usually just use this part. I don't think I've ever used this one. I think it's just too like flyaway-ish. But let me just show you. I still have good stuff left over. Look at that still have good stuff it does not come out until you wash it out like you shampoo your hair out but i will tell you if you touch it if you rub it girl it comes off it comes off and it's so just be careful because it's super duper messy i have other root touch-ups actually i'll talk about that one next but i will tell you um this is my all-time favorite in the whole wide world in the whole wide world i speak of another root touch-up i really really love this rita hazan i hope i'm pronouncing this right this is the root touch-up in um i don't know why i had the light brown why because i'm not really i'm not light at all i love this one when it gets really ugly girl when i'm talking like when it gets real ugly and like that little bit of brushing here and there is just my my gray is just so overwhelming I will use this because it comes with a nozzle. You see that it comes with a nozzle and I just spray and go to town. Like if I'm going somewhere, if I'm doing something that it's in between um, hair colors and like the cutie patootie little brush girl, it's not, it's not happening. It's not going to work. I will just use this. I like it because the nozzle is um, precise. So I will go in and spray um, bigger chunks of gray hair. Love this. Speaking of hair, do girl, might as well. I picked up, hold it, it's going to make a lot of noise. I picked up this Briogeo Be Kind, Be Gentle, Be Kind um, shampoo and conditioner. I, I want to say probably, God, it must have been like maybe, who the heck knows, probably February or March. I don't even remember. But this is their Banana and Coconut Nourishing Superfood Conditioner and Shampoo. Girl, I got to tell you the truth. I mean, it smells fantabulous because you know how I feel about coconut. It smells super de duper good. Um, but I don't... Um, I try to wash my hair maybe once a week. I, I try. I, I, I could barely get away with it, but like I really don't like to wash my hair that often. I don't, um, God, I know this is going to sound terrible, but I don't take care of my hair the way I should. And only because um, I don't care. 
does that sound terrible? I don't care. Like most of the most of the days, my hair is in a babushka. I work in an operating room. My hair is always pulled back. It's always in a bonnet. Um, so those that goes like my three days out of the week. Um, and then other times, like I will like leave it down like this. Like to, I just washed it a couple of days ago. I had it curly. So that was like two days. Then today I straightened it a little bit. So it's going to be like this for another like two days. And then if it gets really ugly sometimes, um, you know, I'll leave this like it back. I'll put it in a ponytail. I'll put it in a bun. So I really don't, um, God, I know that sounds terrible. Not that I don't care about my hair. I just don't, um, have enough knowledge, nor do I care to have enough knowledge. Does that sound bad? Because I really don't do much with it. I really don't do much with it. So uh, I just shampoo, condition my hair. This was, it was beautiful, but I can't say that it was like, oh my God, my hair was fantabulous. It's very nice. I will not order it again. I just like the way it smells. That was the moral of the story. That's the moral of the story. I'm going to backtrack with my makeup cleansers. This is the Tatcha, uh, the, Camellia, the Camellia cleansing oil, again with the friggin' oils. This is so friggin' good. I, I have one backup and actually I just ordered two more. Where were, where, why did I order two more? It must have been like a sale. Buy one, get 50% off. I don't remember. I, the reason why I love this so, so much is that I don't need to wet my face. I don't need to wet my hands. I don't need to like get a washcloth to get the oil or the balm feeling off. It comes off just with warm water. It's so good. I'll put like two pumps face and I will take the rest off and I just rinse. I don't have to get a washcloth. I don't have to get like wipes. It just washes right off. And then I go in with another cleanser. This is so friggin' good. This to me by far is the best oil based makeup remover I have ever, ever used. It's so friggin' good. Although I will tell you, it went up a couple of dollars because if, if I'm not mistaken, this is like $48 and I just went to go purchase it another 50. I'm just saying it's $2, but $2 here, $2 there adds up. Okay. So then my next, I'm going to just, this can be loud. So these are in my morning routines. This is a timeless skincare, 20% vitamin C and fluoruric acid and vitamin C. I got one Mississippi. I got two Mississippi. I got three. Oh, just three. Yeah. I got three Mississippis. These are so good. And just be on alert that I know you can get them on Amazon. Yes, I think you can. You can get everything on Amazon. But I will tell you, Timeless always has like um, ads. Like they're, also, they're always like 25% off, 20% off, 50% off, buy one, get blah, blah, blah. I love this. So I use this in the morning. Fantabulous. With with the Timeless Coenzyme Q10 Serum. So I use this in the morning as well. I might as well just show you now that I'm here. And then I use um, the, the Good Molecule Niacinamide Serum. So I use these three every morning. And again, like I said, I'm up super de dupery doopy, super de duper early. I don't have time to sit there um, and, and, uh, have five or oh, five minutes in between with till it absorbs. I ain't got time for that shit in the morning. I am out the door like early. What I love is that I could just like boom, boom, boom. And it, it literally has changed my face. I saw this on the recommendation of Laura. I, um, Laura Fegelman. I will leave her channel below and she made a comment of her morning routine with this, with these three right here. And it just brightened up and lightened up her face. And I, I cannot agree more. I have a lot of hyperpigmentation on the sides, which I use as the homemade contour. Thank you. Don't be jealous. Don't be jealous. It doesn't look good on you. I have hyperpigmentation right over here, a little bit over here. And Girl, come the summertime, I don't care how much sunblock you wear, hat, partridge, pear tree, sunglasses, the minute the sun hits your face, they pop right out. But in the fall or in the winter time, it my skin looks so good. I, I really, really love these. Girl, I should put these on auto. Here's here's another one. I should put these on auto delivery. So that is that. Girl, I picked up this um this Beauty Pie Uber Youth Neck and Neck and Chest Super Lift Serum Spray. This is with niacinamide and Ida Lift. I guess that's their lift. 
I mean, girl, I used it. I tried the whole friggin' thing. I didn't... I mean, I look, girl, I have big breasts. I am big-breasted. When I go to sleep at night and it's crunchy, I have, like, all the... Let me stand up for you a little bit. I have, like, all these, like, wrinkles, like, over here. Although I do have those silicone pads. Like, why don't I friggin' use it? Yeah, let me use it. I'm going to do it tonight. But, um... You know, it. I did all the zhuzhuzhing and all that. I don't think, and P.S., I love Beauty Pie. I have their, um, I'm on their membership, so their products are phenomenal ingredients. Made in Japan, made in Switzerland, made in Italy, made in France. Their skincare is great. By the way, I was just looking through their stuff to get, like, um, new skincare that I wanted to try. Um, but this was okay. I don't think, um, I don't think it did anything, but that's just my opinion. Amen. Just saying, just I'm telling you the truth, telling you the truth. Oh, hi, little lover. Speaking of It Cosmetics, for this is the It Confidence in a Cream. Um, yep, all gone. And I will tell you this, this, this is supposed to be unscented, anti-aging. It has a, I don't want to say chemical. It has a scent. No, this can't be unscented. But it has a scent that I'm not really crazy about. It's not pleasant. But it's not, it's not like, you know, you smell like barf. I'm not talking about that, but... It's kind of like chemically, if it wasn't for the scent I would adore, I just love. But I really love this. It is so super thick. This is what I use for my moisturizer um, at night, which just remind me, remind me at night. Um, so good. It does say that you can use this for morning and night. Girl, it, to, for me personally, it is way, way, way too thick um, for the morning. But I adore, adore this. I have been lately, let me just segue. Um, to this Neutrogena um, Rapid Wrinkle Repair. Uh, this is the Accelerated Retinol um, Cream that I was watching Dominique Soxite. I, I will link her below. But she was uh, she did a video with her dermatologist talking about um, retinol and retinoids and if you need a prescription for retinoids, blah, blah, yeah. Okay, I got, I, I'm nowhere near that, I don't think. But anyway, I would love to incorporate a retinol, which you can get over the counter, um, into my skin routine. So I was using this at night with this. Friggin' really all gone. This has a nice, lovely scent to it. But I, I grabbed an oil. Did I grab it by accident? Probably not. I'm a, I can't remember why, but I grabbed an oil. So what I've been doing, do I have a backup of this? I'm not sure. So what I've been doing um, is that I will take like a scoop of my night lotion and then I will throw in some of the drops. It is exactly like this, the Neutrogena Rapid Wrinkle Repair um, Retinol, but in um, serum drops. And I will put that in my moisturizer just at night. So those two are that. We're almost done, I think. Um, I think I have th three more products left. Girl, I don't have to say anything about this, do I? Not a word. But I'm going to tell you anyway. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. Party all night. Stay all night. This is so great. I mean, I don't have to tell you anything. It is so freaking good. I am on my third bottle, maybe. Maybe second. Because I had a mini one. I had a mini one that I tried first. Then I bought this. It's so freaking good. I don't have to tell you. I mean, it is like um, hairspray when you spray it. I remember Mel was not a fan of this. She actually liked the um, the Milk Makeup Power Grip. The Milk Makeup setting spray, you know, you got to shake it. She liked that one better. She said this one felt like hairspray. To me, they both feel like hairspray. This one a little bit more. But to me, it dissipates. Once the hairspray, and then it goes away. This is fantastic. Um, your makeup will not budge. Love, love, love that. And then um, last but not least, no, not last but not least. I have one, and then last but not least, I adore this Bondi Sand um, self-tanning foam. I remember Carly Bible was talking about it and I was like, girl, I don't know how you guys sleep with self-tanner on. Like I'm looking, I'm in my daughter's room. She's at college. So I usually come into her room um, to film. And as I'm looking at her white bedspread, I'm like, girl, it is so friggin' filthy. She, well, that's tanner. I, first of all, tanners smell. I don't care what you say. No, this one does. They all smell like hell. Um, you're wrong. I would, I would never sleep if I had tanner on. Anyway, Girl, the reason why I love this Bondi Sand, this is the Australian tan. This is the one hour express one. They have like light, dark, uh, eight hours, this like regular tanner. But this is a one hour express coconut scent. Stop lying. It smells like shit. They all do. 
Come on. Although this smells the least, but girl, you, you know I'm a coconut queen. This does not smell like coconut. But anyway, quick drying formula. Yes, one hour espresso. If you leave it on for an hour, it'll give you a nice um, tan. But if you leave it on like two to three hours, it'll give you like your darkest. So girl, I will put this on at like, I don't know, in the morning, like nine, 10 o'clock in the morning. And uh, yeah, I'll let it go four, five, six hours until I get in the shower like that day. I would never fall asleep. Blech, it just, they just smell and it'll get, mm -mm, mm -mm, hell no. But anyway, so, so beautiful. When I first, like when I first started, I'm like, it looked green. It looked like an olive green. I'm like, oh Jesus, no. What, like what? But girl, when this sleeps in and it does its magic and you like wash it off, it's beautiful once you wash and rinse everything off. It is gorgeous. Um, like I said, I'm not the queen of self tanning, but this, if I'm going to tan, I'm going to use this. Love, love, love. And then last but not least, girl, it's over. It's over. If you guys have followed me, I have been loving this. Damn it, Bath and Body Works. I don't know why. Why you do me wrong? Why did you do me wrong? This is the Coco Shake. Uh, moisturizing body oil in coconut well I'm not gonna lie girl I, I have a little bit left over for maybe um, my upper body perhaps I of course they discontinued it daggone it it's the coconut I absolutely love it these are the last I bought on um, Amazon and I bought them all. And if you had 12, I friggin' bought them. I did not care. But now I think someone sent me like a link and it was ridiculous, like $70 for one. Let's not get crazy. I just actually just picked up the Palmer um, moisturizing oil. It was like the cocoa, but I think they had a coconut scent. I just, Amazon just delivered it like yesterday. I just took it out of the package. So I am going to try that, but it's over. I have to tell you, I've been using this. Oof, it's got to be 10 years. It's got to be 10 years, which I love, of course, any kind of beautiful, beautiful body oil, right? As soon as I get out of the shower, I don't mean, I don't even get out of the shower. I chop my water off. I do like one of these to get the excess water off. I drench my body in um, this coconut oil. So good. Cocoa butter, shea butter. I'm going to miss you, damn it. Um, we had some good times together. Um, that's it. And I will just pat dry my skin with a towel. It is so friggin' fantastic. <sighs> if for the love of God, anybody knows where I can get this Bath and Body Works, please let me know. Leave me some links below. I'm going to miss you. We had some good times together. We had some good stories to tell between me and you. Good stories. But anyway, that's it. Holy shishka bibble. Are we done? I think we're done. So that is it. This is my empties. I have no friggin' clue how long this video is going to be, but I hope it's shorter. I'll try to edit it as much as I can. And that's it. This is my empties video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for sharing your time with me. And as always, you guys be good to each other, love each other, and have a great, great day. Bye.